in this lecture we should learn about different components of water cooling system a water cooling system is required for any motor automobile even the tractors which work on our farms a water cooling system has the following components first is the radiator second is the pressure cap which is mounted on top of the radiator third is fan and fan belt fourth is water jackets and cylinder block and head fifth is thermostat valve sixth is hose pipe and seventh is the water and water pump what is a radiator a radiator is a device which has a large amount of cooling surface to large quantity of air so that water circulates through it is cooled efficiently it consists of an upper tank and lower tank and between them is a core consisting of very fine tubes through which water is carried from the upper tank to the lower tank the upper tank is connected to the water outlet from the engine jacket by a hose pipe and the lower tank is connected to the jacket inlet through the water pump as shown in the figure 4.25 in this figure you can see the picture of a radiator the radiator consists of three parts first is the upper tank on which a pressurized cap is mounted then you have the lower tank and these two tanks upper tank and lower tanks are connected by fine tubes through which air can pass easily and carry away the heat of the heated water contained in these tubes the uh, water pipe uh, from the lower tank goes to the water jacket of the engine and from the water jacket the water after getting heated taking away the heat of the engine it goes back to the upper tank and from the upper tank it travels down to the lower tank through the fine tubes due to gravity and in this process the water gets cooled through the passing of cool air 